your body can need mending in all sorts of ways, and we're going to meet some special teams that are trained to fix you. <laughs> Let me show you my ear. Never put anything in your ear, by the way, unless you're a doctor like me. There is my eardrum. It vibrates so we can hear sounds. On my eardrum, you can see some old scars because it burst because of infection when I was younger. Now, my eardrum works perfectly fine now, but when I was eight, I had a problem called a glue ear. Now, that doesn't mean that my ears were actually producing glue. Inside my right ear, it was producing a gloopy, thick fluid, like very thick snot, which meant I couldn't hear very well. Well, believe it or not, this is very common. 80% of people have had it by the time they're 10. Glue ear can cause earache, and sometimes it can go on its own. But if you're struggling to hear, then surgery is required in your eardrum. This is Kieran. He's at Royal Manchester Children's Hospital, and today he's having a tiny plastic tube fitted called a grommet. And do you know what these tubes are going to do? No? The tubes sit in your eardrum, and there's fluid behind your eardrum, so they let the fluid drain out, and that stops you getting earaches, it stops you getting infections, and it stops you going deaf. So, to understand it properly, grommets sit in the eardrum. There's a grommet in an eardrum just like mine earlier. But that hole is very important. It lets the air in to relieve any pressure buildup. Would well, that be good to have it all fixed? Yeah. Time to scrub up and get ready for surgery. Carrying out the procedure today is Miss Jaya Nichani, ear, nose and throat surgeon. It usually settles down by itself. Uh, it's when it won't settle down and they have problem with it because they can't hear, that's when we've got to do something about it. And that's exactly the case with Kieran. The grommet itself is tiny and it is going into a tiny space. So the first thing Jai is going to do is stick a vacuum cleaner down there and try and suck out some of the fluid and then we've got to remove the glue, which is the sticky stuff. Can you hear that glue coming out now? The noise? There we go, glue. Out you come. This is really satisfying watching this. I'm really, really enjoying this. With the goo removed, Jaya can now put the grommet in place. It's very precise work as Jaya places the grommet exactly in the tiny cut she's made in Kieran's eardrum. Well, there it is. That's great. So Kieran has got quite small ear holes. So imagine how hard it is to put something that small in exactly the right place. It's amazing. Kieran's got glue ear in both ears, so he gets two. It means we'll be able to hear well and no more earaches. Brilliant. The grommets will be staying in for up to six months, then they just fall out without him even noticing. By then, Kieran should have outgrown the problem and be all better. Let's see how he is after the op. Can you hear any differently now? Can you hear your mum talking a bit more easily? Well, that's great. Give me a high five. 